With many similarities to the Labrador and Golden Retriever, it's easy to get the flat-coated Retriever mixed up with these breeds. Because of random crosses between breeds, this dog's origin is fairly uncertain. However, ancient records claim that they're one of the oldest Retrievers in existence, having created many variations of the breed, including the Golden Retriever. In past centuries, the flat-coated Retriever gained popularity as a hunting dog, being able to move well on land and across water. While not particularly popular as a family dog compared to the other Retrievers, they have earned a reputation as being one of the more underrated types of dog. Time for some rough trivia. Which season of the year is the flat-coated Retriever most sensitive to? Is it summer, winter, or spring? What do you think? Give it your best guess in the comments below before we get to the answer. Hang on tight and we'll get back to this rough trivia question toward the end of the video. The flat-coated retriever is distinguished from the rest of the retriever family for having a wider head and being lighter than other retrievers. They also stand out for their slender build, small ears, and short, straight tail. They usually weigh between 60 to 70 pounds and measure up to 25 inches tall. They have a very dense double layer of hair, making them resistant to cold and water. They usually come in black, brown, or a liver color. Check out brooklynscorner.com to learn more about what makes the flat-coated retriever so great. Grooming. These guys are very easy to maintain, and their fur does not tangle very often. With this in mind, they'll need occasional brushing to eliminate dirt and dead hair. The ears should be inspected and cleaned regularly, the nails should be trimmed often, and the teeth need daily brushing. Temperament. Flat-coated retrievers are balanced and friendly dogs, which their owners experience firsthand. They'll always be there to greet you when you get home, and they're always up for playtime. Learn more about this patient and loyal breed and why they might make the perfect fit for your family on brooklynscorner.com. Training. Known for being more active and restless than their golden retriever cousins, training can sometimes be a challenge for this breed. However, their intelligence and eagerness to please their owners will ultimately give way to positive results. Of course, it's up to the owner to provide constant positive training. Health. Flat-coated retrievers are generally of good health and aren't too prone to many genetic diseases. On the other hand, as with any other dog, they can suffer from hip dysplasia and some forms of cancer. To avoid this, keep them in good health and bring them to regularly scheduled vet checkups. They may be less popular than other kinds of retriever, but that doesn't make the flat-coated retriever any less deserving of a good home. They are a very sociable breed with family and strangers alike, making them ideal for any household, including one with children. Find out if the flat-coated retriever would be a good addition to your home. Visit brooklynscorner.com and take our quiz to find out which dog would be the best match for you. Now let's get back to our rough trivia question. Summer is the worst time of the year for these dogs because they're highly sensitive to heat. On a day that's merely warm, not even hot, a flat coat can overheat quickly. Be alert for signs of heat stroke because your flat coat may be having too much fun to realize that he's getting too hot. That does it for the flat coated retriever. If you enjoyed this Dog Facts 101 video, be sure to subscribe and paw that thumbs up button. Then go ahead and check out some of our other videos and fun activities on our website. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.